trainer and nutritionist and today I have a ballet inspired full body no equipment workout. The workout begins with a warm up, we'll do the workout itself, then you have cool down stretches when we're done. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel and if you would like to help contribute, you can go to my channel page in the about there's a link for donations. Before we begin, I have an inspirational phrase to share with you. It says, life is not to elude adversity, but to embrace it. When challenge clenches you, surprise it and grab back. And I like this because trials and troubles, difficulties, though maybe not the most pleasant thing, they are to help us grow. You level up, per se, every time you face a challenge. You learn something and it's also what it takes to help you to get where you want to be. Maybe you can look back in your life at a time when you were hoping for something and then the, the trouble arose and you had to face some difficulty, but in the ultimate end, you got what you wanted. And I know for me, that holds true. And some of the greatest difficulties in my life have brought me some of the greatest things that I have. And so hopefully the same is for you, and I, I firmly believe it. And another thing is to have spirit. So even though, no matter what, whether you're mopey about it or whether you're spirited, when you're facing a difficulty, you're still going to have to get through it. So it's best to keep a good mindset through it, um, knowing that, that you will succeed at the end and that this is just temporary. So now we can begin our warm-up. The first thing that we have is called bird wings, and it's going to open up the upper body. So you're going to bring your wrists together in front of you, like so, and then expand out, squeezing between your shoulder blades. Then you're going to come up. Again, bringing your wrists together and then down into a T pose. So that is one, and we're going to do that five times. Then we're on to the next part of our warm-up, which is a full body stretch. It's called arm swing. So you're going to reach up. You're going to swing your body down into a squat and then stand back up, expanding or trying to reach up or elongate the body as you come up. So we're going to do that five times. to our next movement. So we're going to have a slight bend in the leg. You're going to bring your leg up and then arabesque back. So 
you're bearing your weight on one leg, you have like a quarter bend there, bring your leg in front, tap up, bring it back, arabesque. That is one. Now we're going to do that ten times and then switch. You want to keep this leg in this quarter bend the whole time. It's really going to work all the muscles of your leg. Once you've done all ten, switch. We're on to our next exercise, which is going to be a plie, and then we're moving into a side lunge with sphere arms. So you're going to plie, move into your side lunge, sphere arms. And you can just stay in the low part of the movement the whole time while we alternate for 12. And then we're on to our next exercise, which is only focused on the upper body. So we're going to begin in a T, and then move into a sphere, and then switch. So we're going to do that ten times. Next thing that we're going to be doing is an around the world plie. So you're going to plie, big plie, and you're going to reach your arms around like so, and then come back the other way. And we're going to alternate for 12. To travel to the floor or some cool down stretches. So we're going to begin with a figure four that's going to stretch the hip. So you're going to lay down, bring one leg up and over, and then draw it in. We're going to hold.
After brief pause, switch. Easy pose, and we're going to alternate side reaches. So we're going to alternate for eight. Let's begin. And that concludes our ballet inspired full body workout. Hope you enjoyed it. Please check out more of my other videos on YouTube under Wellness by Elizabeth and like, subscribe, and share.